いどうも皆さんこんにちはサワヤンカルチャーですさあシャーということで本日なんですけどもいよいよやってきてまいりました日本といえばそうお寿司でございます本日はですね、えー、西麻布にございます、えー、寿司海進というところにですねお邪魔させていただき、えー、日本の、えー、お寿司職人のトップの技をね、えー、存分に堪能,し堪能していきたいと思うのでねぜひ最後までご視聴いただけると嬉しいです世界どこに行ってもこの味は楽しめません日本のみでございますでは行きましょうか感動の準備はよろしいでしょうかレッツゴー。Today, we're in Nishi Azabu. It's an upscale district located in the Minato Ward. It's located near three metro stations, so it's easily accessible. Detailed directions can be found on the description box. The interior of the restaurant is very upscale. It's a luxurious and high end sushi restaurant, and you can tell the moment you step in. Everything from the furnishings to the vibes are upscale. In front of the counter, you'll see the fresh ingredients used in the sushi. These fish are brought into the store straight from the market. The clear glass allows you to see the freshness of the ingredients, which is reassuring. The first ingredient is bloody clam. You can't see it in the video, but the bloody clam was alive only moments ago and it moves. Bloody clams are a great source of vitamin B12. Grilled hair tail is very fragrant and the umami from the fat will spread in your mouth. It's super delicious. Botan shrimp has a very nice texture and a very sweet flavor. Botan shrimp is a great source of protein, vitamin E, and zinc. Today, we're going to combine the sweet shrimp flavor with sea urchin sauce. The umami from the sea urchin, combined with the melting sweetness of the botan shrimp, is a completely new sensation. Look at the glossy texture of this dish. It's a work of art made by skilled sushi chefs. Texture of pregnant spear squid is indescribable. It's fluffy and has the right firmness. The slight bitterness of the innards complements the sweet sauce extremely well. The pregnant spear squid comes in a unique bowl. It's very elegant. Now let's see what it tastes like. Black throat sea perch is a very tasty fish that lives in deep waters. In Japanese, it's called nodoguro, which literally means black throat. As the name suggests, the fish is known for having a black throat. Black throat sea perch is known for being very fatty. It has a sweet flavor and aroma. When served as a sushi, the flesh of the black throat sea perch mixes with the rice. Spreading the umami throughout your mouth.
Look at those scallops. Have you ever seen scallops so thick? Normally, scallops are eaten either raw or grilled. It's not often you see scallop tempura. The scallop tempura at Kaishin has an exquisite texture and the perfect doneness. The center of the scallop is rather rare, giving it that firm texture that everybody loves. Visually, it looks stunning. The bright color of the crust contrasts with the black plate, giving it that high-end look. Let's see what it tastes like. Spotted sardines are a very nutritious and delicious dish. The fish is considered to be in season between November and December, but can be found in sushi establishments throughout the year. Since the fish has a very strong smell, it is usually pickled in salt or vinegar before it is served to dilute the smell. At Kaishin, you can see the sushi chef making the rice to match the fish. Because the sushi is made in a very particular way, the finished product is one that is very refreshing. It also tests the skills of the sushi chef because the fish has to be cut in a shallow manner. It's a delicate dish which makes it very visually appealing. The sushi is made in a rather unique way. Instead of using one big slice of flesh, many small slices are stacked on top of one another to produce an exquisite taste. Today, pilchard is a popular sushi. However, it was not until after World War II that it was popularized. The reason is because the fish spoils extremely quickly due to its high omega-3 fat content. Prior to the spread of refrigeration technology, pilchard was eaten only after being grilled. To serve it as a sushi, the fish is salted to remove the water. Then, it is marinated in rice vinegar. When served as a sushi, the skin is left on. To prevent the flavor of the fish from being overpowering, Small slices are used and stacked on top of one another. That way, the fish melts in your mouth, allowing you to taste the umami. It has a hint of sourness, which goes great with the rice. Opelio crab is a species of snow crab. For this sushi, the crab is shredded into fine pieces. What's surprising is that if you look at the amount of crab on the sushi, you'll notice that there's probably more crab than rice. In fact, there's almost twice as much crab as there is rice. The moment you put the sushi into your mouth, the umami of the crab and the tamale spread throughout. Fatty tuna is a classic sushi dish. It's the fatty area of the tuna belly and it'll melt in your mouth. It looks oily, but it's not, and it just melts in your mouth. Compared to the leaner cuts of tuna, these cuts are more expensive due to their relative scarcity as a proportion of the entire fish. Okay. 
切り札みたいなもの。やば。This is shrimp. Shrimp is another classical sushi dish. But we're at Kaishin. There's going to be something unique. At Kaishin, they're very particular about how they make their shrimp sushi. Specifically, as you can see, they use the tamales and mix it with the flesh. Then, the mixture is placed in the middle of the flesh. And served on top of the rice. The umami of the shrimp flesh and the combination of the flesh and tamale gives it a completely unique taste. The moment you eat the sushi, the taste of shrimp spreads throughout your mouth. Talk about luxurious. Sea urchin is a very popular sushi dish. Today, we're going to eat it as a roll. But it's going to be a very luxurious roll. Look at how much sea urchin is being used for each roll. It's a massive scoop of sea urchin. There is nothing more luxurious than such a large portion of sea urchin for one single serving. The moment you take a bite, the flavor of the sea urchin spreads throughout your mouth. The fragrance and aftertaste will leave you with a sense of happiness. What a perfect way to end this meal!最高。はいということで皆さんいかがだったでしょうか、えー、やはりですね、えー、一流の技そして特にお寿司となった場合はですね、えー、日本ではや,やはりね世界いろんな国々ありますけれどもトップオブトップの技は日本でしか味わえませんそれをね存分に今回の動画で確認できたのではないでしょうかぜひ一度ね日本に来られた際にはこちらのね、えー、西麻布にございます海士に足を一応運んでいただき一流の技を肌で体感してみてはいかがでしょうか本日も最後までご視聴ありがとうございましたまた次回の動画でお会いしましょう How was it, everyone? This is the best of the best when it comes to sushi. Authentic sushi can only be tasted in Japan. If you're in the country, we highly recommend Kaishin in Nishiyazabu to try world class sushi. When you try it, you'll see why we recommend it so much. Thanks for watching until the end. See you next time on Sawayan Culture. Bye.